a name the Laker faithful know all too well. His heiress, Michael Jordan, makes his final trip to Los Angeles, where he'll be met by the reigning champs led by Kobe Bryant. Will this be the game where Jordan passes the torch to Kobe as the preeminent guard in the NBA? Lakers, Wizards, coming up. Puts on the brakes, fires the three over Stackhouse, got it! This is unreal, and if I'm Washington, I'm getting very worried right now. Simmons is on Kobe Bryant. He'll let it fly from three. Good! Kobe's in the zone like this. He is unguardable. To do this on Jordan's last game in this building? My goodness. And Kobe lets it fly. Eyes turn it again. What a performance. Bryant picked up by Lou above the line. Now they double. Now he fires. Got it. Kobe with a three. You better believe he's letting that fly. There is no answer for Kobe Bryant right now. Kobe Bryant absolutely incredible. And listen to this crowd. They know they're witnessing greatness. And Kobe checks out with 55. 42 in the first half of franchise record. Lights, camera, action. It's always a show in Hollywood, especially when the Lakers are in town. Inside Staples Center, MJ and Kobe ready to go at it. Let's throw it downstairs to legendary Lakers PA announcer, Lawrence Tanner. Get tonight started. And now, celebrating their 43rd year in Southern California, the fans eyes with 14 NBA titles, the most wins in NBA history, the whole team. Defending back to back to back NBA World Champions, your Los Angeles Lakers. At forward number 35, 6 9, third year from Stanford, Mark Madsen. At one forward, number 17, 6 7, 12th year from North Carolina. And one guard, number two, six one, seventh year from Arkansas, Little Rock, Derek Mitchell. The other guard is number eight, six six, seventh year from Lower Marion High School, Kobe. And at center, number 34, Southern Rock, 11th campaign out of LSU, Jackie The head coach of Lakers, Bill Jackson. everyone we've got a great one for you on this Friday night it's the Washington Wizards coming into LA to take on the Lakers I'm Kevin Harlan with Mike Fratello and Clark Kellogg David Aldridge will join us from the sideline hey Mike what are you looking for in this one well I know everyone wants to see Kobe and Jordan go head to head they're the old and the new as far as elite shooting guards go they mirror each other in how they play. And Mike, the Lakers are trying to finish strong and strengthen their place in the Western Conference the playoff picture. And Clark, it is crowded. Hey, you know what, Kevin? In March, every game can have that playoff feel, if you will. And with seeding possibly really tight in the West, I don't think the Lakers are going to hold any of their players back. Now the starters for Washington. Jerron Liu is the former Laker with Michael Jordan in the backcourt. Jerry Stackhouse will play the three. He's having a great year. Christian Leitner will be at the four with Jahadi White anchoring the team at center. And for the Lakers, Mark Madsen makes the move into the starting lineup at the four. Albert Ory will come off the bench tonight. 
Rick Fox is the other forward. Shaquille O'Neal, of course, starting in the middle. And as always, Derek Fisher and Kobe Bryant are the backcourt tandem. Well, it's a matchup everyone has been dying to see. Kobe Bryant going against Michael Jordan one last time. This is one NBA fans have had circled on their calendars. Now, here is Jordan. He can't hit that time. Outside, Fox. Here's Kobe. Good, and a nice assist from Fox. And Clark, the Kobe-Jordan matchup. It has a little changing of the guard feel to it, don't you think? You're right on top of it, Kevin, and Jordan would be the first one to admit that. I mean, he admires Kobe's passion and approach, but he hopes Jordan has plenty of fight left in him. One of the greatest competitors we've seen in the history of the league, and he's going to look to put his mark on this one. Now here's Kobe. O'Neal sets the screen for Kobe. Look at Kobe. Gets those points right back by answering Jordan on the other end. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Ah, we love this one, don't we, Clark? Kobe and Michael Jordan will be guarding each other a lot, it seems. Yeah, I love it, Kevin. They'll be looking to ramp up their defense in this one. We can count on that. Right at each other all game long. I really like Lou's shot selection. He has a great feel for when to fire away from outside. Outside, Kobe. O'Neal on the wing. Shot clock at five. Over White. Shaq with the bucket. He's a tough guy to guard anywhere on the floor. Shaq does a really good job using his body to gain position. Lou passes to Jordan over Bryant. And Washington again with the bucket. Clearly, he's found his rhythm early in this one. Ticket prices climbed and climbed until tip-off. It was a hot ticket. You can see all the celebrities in attendance tonight. Even for a Lakers game, there's a lot. Guys? Thank you, David. And as always, great Got stuff. It. You could just feel a buzz coming into the stadium tonight. The crowd has been electric. So many different tricks up his sleeve. Makes him a tough matchup. Lou passes to Stackhouse. Nice ball movement by Washington. All sorts of time, and he gets it to go. This is why Stackhouse doesn't need to force his way to the rim. He can hit that shot. Bryant hits them both. He can do so much damage from the line. The defense has to be more careful around him. Pass to Jordan. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's on Shaq. Smart play that time by Jordan, using the pump, baiting the defender, and he bit. Shooting for one. They throw good, Jordan. Taking two shots. So Jordan nails both of them. Brown deciding where to go with it. Hit by Haywood. Here's Jordan. Great touch on the 16-footer. Jordan's got his third bucket of the night. Fantastic work in the screen and roll. Jordan keeping things simple and taking what he sees. Fisher finds Bryant. Kobe goes right back at Michael. Jordan with it. He's got eight. Kobe with the steal. And it's Kobe dropping it in right on Michael. Tell you what, this has been so much fun to watch. Both of these teams throwing haymakers. They're giving the fans their money's worth in this one. Both sides competing at a high level. 129 left in the first quarter. Beyond the arc. No good from Stackhouse. The Lakers in the lead. Three straight titles, and they could be looking at more. Look at 15 points now for Kobe. Still in the first quarter, and he is on a rampage. He is on a heater. Push it, push it, push 
The fader. Here's O'Neal. With the score. It's a challenge trying to keep Shaq off the offensive glass. He's got so much size and strength. We've got 22 seconds left here in the opening quarter. And again, Washington no good. And here are the Lakers. Nine points in a row. Good run for him right now. Bryant. What a start for Kobe Bryant. He now has 17 points here in the first. And Clark all season long. Michael Jordan has meant so much for this Wizards team. Yeah, he's done a little bit of everything as a mentor and a teacher. Sets a great example. Not to mention the assist and rebound numbers he's compiled. Jordan has been doing it all for this team. Now here's Bryant. They lead by eight. That's the biggest of the game. Creating offense through working hard on defense. Boy, I love seeing that. I know you do. Going all the way with it, too. Well, Mike, you were talking about this. The Lakers' defense has been a strength for them all season long. You know where the scoring is going to come from. But this team has bought in defensively all season long. It's been huge for them. Here's Bryant. And the layup's good off the glass. Bryant's got 21. All three of those teams, Kevin, have looked great. Here's Dixon. Stackhouse outside. Buries the long-range jumper. Stackhouse has got five points so far. George comes in for Fox, and it's Pargo in for Fisher. And then for Washington, Kwame Brown. He's checked in for Russell, and it's Lou in for Dixon. Yeah, just another message to the defense that they are in control of this one. I think the message is received. The defense knows these guys are making them look powerless. Here's Lou. Hits it from three-point range. Lou's got to back down to within single digits for Washington. And so Bryant will bring it up for the Lakers. O'Neal sets the screen for Bryant. And Shaq with the slam. Superb work from Shaq. Rolling with confidence after setting the screen. He's got to come through there. It wasn't enough resistance for them to score that one. O'Neal issues to Bryant. Count it. He's got 25 points on the hand. Wizards trail by 13. Here's Lou. Six points for him. Simmons on the wing. And Simmons slams it in. Great vision from Lou. Surveying the floor, keeping his options open. So it's the Lakers now. Outside Bryant. Drops it in for 27 points in this half. And Kobe Bryant had a terrific month of February, Mike. He could not miss. Average over 40 points per game that month. Right. Only Will and Elgin Baylor have ever done that before. I've never seen a player get that hot for a month. So timeout called here. The first for the Wizards. Lakers leading by 13. Bryant up top. Mike covering. Kobe. Over Michael Jordan. And we see Kobe with some gaudy numbers on the year so far, Clark. Just over 30 points a game. Also, seven rebounds and, and almost six assists as well. I mean, he's, he's filling every category. We know he can score. That's clear. The rebounding and the assist numbers, that's what really stands out to me. He's been doing it all this season. Got it. 14 Ooh. points for him in the quarter. O'Neal is freeing on Jordan. Tries the spin move. Here's Kobe. 33 Ooh. points and counting in this half. He is rolling. Shaq doing a nice job setting that screen. Now I eight seconds no separating the two clocks. Michael Jordan on the wing, guarded by Kobe. And Jordan Ooh. comes Ooh. right back and answers Kobe. Shaq passes to Kobe. Over Laker. Can't hit from the elbow. And even though that one didn't go down, that's a really good shot selection. This is what the coaches are encouraging, even when these type of shots don't fall. They've got their field goal percentage to thank for that. They've been hot from all over the floor tonight. Back right after this.
All right, halftime has come and gone for the Lakers and Wizards. Third quarter action getting started here at Staples. So often this year, we've heard all the comparisons between Kobe Bryant and Michael Jordan. And to be quite frank, they are warranted. Kobe is the closest thing to Jordan we have yet to see. This season has cemented that as the truth. Here's Lou. Jordan outside. And Jordan making the jumper look easy over Kobe right there. Here's Lou. Six points for him. Leitner the pass to Jordan. And there it is for him. Michael Jordan's got four points now in the quarter. Smooth as silk. MJ with one of the best pull-up jumpers you'll ever see. Jordan against Bryant. And Kobe not wasting any time. Gets the bucket on Michael. Found the crease, took advantage, and got it in close. And edge to this lead. They're having their way. Well, coming into this game, Michael Jordan was stringing together a number of great performances. I mean, just jaw dropping. Yeah, three straight games of 20 points or more for Michael. He also had that 39 point outburst at the start of the month. You know, it's really amazing to think he's still able to put up points like that at this stage in his career. Wizards trail by 17. Stackhouse outside. Pass to Lou. Feeds to Jordan. It's blocked by Shaq. Great on both ends of the floor. Shaq making his presence felt defensively there. Sending one back. Ori passes to O'Neal. And Shaq with the slam. Expertly placed bounce pass, avoiding interference and getting it to the shooter. Here's Lou. Six points for him. Stackhouse outside. Shoots over Fox. Stackhouse good. Stackhouse has got his third basket of the night right there. Teron Lou showing you exactly what you want from a point guard. Excellent decision making running the show. Now Fisher hasn't made one yet. Kobe hitting the 40 point mark once again. And Mike, you gotta shoot it quick. I'm getting to that. Go ahead, y'all ready. The pass to Leitner. Here's Jordan. And Jordan gets the points right back with an answer for Bryant. Time out, time out. Michael Jordan Clark has not been slowed in the scoring department on his way to pass his season average. Well, you know what, Kevin? If there was a way to slow up Jordan, somebody surely would have figured it out by now. Bryant outside. Six on the shot clock. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It's going to be on Michael Jordan. So there's a reason it was way off. He got fouled. Yeah, easy whistle. Los Angeles shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. Two shots. First one falls for him. Margo, he's checked in for Los Angeles. The last time this franchise got a road win against the Lakers was more than 10 years ago. It was Valentine's Day of 1992 when the Wizards last won here. That would leave any Washington fan with lots of broken hearts. Back to you guys. David, thank you. It's been a long time, Mike, coming for Wizards fans. Some teams just have your number. That's been the case for Washington and the Lakers for quite some time. Jordan, and it's blocked. What a play as he just snatches the shot out of midair. And Kobe, here we go. Connects. He's got 17 this quarter. And, you know, their lead just continues to grow. And it's not just because of their offense. They're getting it done at both ends. Yeah, their defense has been stellar as well. Great work on both ends. Russell with a wide open look. The Wizards with another miss. Like they've captured an impressive lead. Oh, yeah. They're in the driver's seat right now, Kevin. Both hands on the wheel. Here's O'Neal. Oh, the jam by O'Neal! And that's a double-double for him now. 
10 points and 15 rebounds. But the Lakers have historically found success against Jordan. Now here's Bryant over Jordan. Got it. He's got 54. Well, it's really hard to come back if you can't get stops. You've got to figure out a way to stop the bleeding if you're going to come back. And he looked very comfortable on that one. Not a lot of resistance. Lou passes to Simmons. Here's Lou. Passes it to Jordan. Shoots over Kobe. Or as they Michael say Jordan. anything you can do, I can do better. Michael answers Kobe right away. Outside, Bryant. O'Neal sets the screen for Bryant. Trying to find Shaq. He's got it now. And the dunk by O'Neal. Bottom line, that's an unstoppable move. Shaq can do this anytime he wants. O'Neal's gone a terrific six of eight shooting from the floor. And Mike, Michael Jordan now is over his season average for points. You figured it was coming. Jordan was going to be very aggressive in this one going up against Kobe, hoping to stretch the floor. He does a bit of everything for this team. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth quarter. Offensive rebound. Shaq with the bucket. O'Neal's got four points now in the fourth quarter. Battling for the second chance points there. That kind of effort is why they've got the lead. Defensively, they need to match that energy. Well, they'll have a difficult time getting back into this game. Now, here is Jordan. And Kobe Bryant gets the whistle that time. That's, that's, that's foul that's number two for him. Jerry Stacker is checked in for Washington. Checking in for the Wizards, number 42, Jerry Stackhouse. Second minute off the clock now in the fourth. Clock at four. And Shaquille O'Neal pulls it down. Shaq's got his 18th rebound here tonight. All over the place. Kobe Bryant the 55 point mark. What an absolute spectacle he has been here tonight. Flying up high. What a move. You're right, Clark. The elevation. Incredible. I almost thought he was getting too much air. Short and plenty of contact on the shot. So two free throws coming up. And there's the foul against the Lakers. Defense tries a little too hard to stop Jordan. And he smartly draws the foul. Michael Jordan. Two shots. Shooting two. That one is off. The blend of athleticism and scoring prowess Jordan possesses is insane. He's capable of destroying teams all by himself. Los Angeles making a switch here. Rush is checked in. Brown is checked in for Washington. No good on the second free throw. And here's O'Neal. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. O'Neal on the wing. O'Neal is double. Outside, Fox. That's in, coming off the assist from O'Neal. Here's Jordan, and Jordan Michael slams it in. This is why so many love watching Jordan play. Such an explosive dunker. Outside, Fox. Now the pass to Ori. Looks for O'Neal, gets it to him. And the dunk by O'Neal. He's making it happen offensively, doing his part to craft this lead. And shot opportunity. It's blocked by Shaq. And he recovers it. Stackhouse, Jerry good. Stack. Here's the screen. Uncovered. And the basket is good. Jerry Stackhouse Stack. has a superb jump shot. A real score. This guy is attacking and squaring himself up to the basket. Seven seconds left in the fourth quarter. And the Lakers win on the back of an incredible Kobe Bryant performance. Certainly one for the ages. You could feel something special was going to happen tonight. Kobe versus Jordan. And boy, it did not disappoint. And the way Clark that Kobe racked up the points, he was on a mission. And look, he might not confess it publicly, Kevin, but this game meant more 
than a typical regular season game. I mean, this was Kobe letting everybody know that it's his NBA from here on out. And we've got David Aldridge standing by on our sideline with the player of the game. David, it's all yours. Thank you, Kevin, here with Kobe Bryant. A great performance tonight. How were you feeling? No, I, just, I felt pretty good. You know, I felt like I got in a pretty good rhythm early in the game. And, uh, you know, just wanted to keep on attack and try to keep us in this one. Well, you certainly did the job tonight, Kobe. Congrats on the win. Kevin? All right, D.A., thanks again. For our terrific reporter, David Aldridge, along with Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello, I'm Kevin Harlan saying thank you for tuning in tonight. We'll see you later.